Hello friends and welcome to my channel. My name is Sarah and in today's video we are going to be doing the beadboard wall and trimming the rest of it out. And sorry if you can hear my little guy in the background. He is home from school today and he's just playing and grinding his teeth. But he is here while I'm editing. But we are getting this beadboard wall done. I am just marking out how high I want the beadboard to go up on the wall. So that's currently what I'm doing and then I will get into doing the beadboard wallpaper and then trimming the rest of it out. And I absolutely love how it turned out and I cannot wait to share it with you guys. Full stop Can't believe I live in your thoughts I think about you all the time Morning, evening and midnight Such a wonderful delight Forgo Give up everything that I
Okay, friends, I have finished the wall. It's ready for painting. I got all of the trim on. I'm so excited. Now, here's, it's kind of not really a dilemma, but I need to figure out which, if I want to do hooks or not, and I'm kind of leaning towards the hooks, but do I do the pegs like I did in the mudroom or do I do brass hooks? I will insert a picture up here of like my inspiration. There's a um, an account I follow on Instagram that I really love and she has brass hooks and she does it like, like a wall like this as well, but she has brass hooks and I think I might do the brass hooks for something different. I really like it and I don't know. I will put up a picture. You guys let me know what you think. The next step is to texture sorry I know it's dark is to take off the rest of the battens and texture the top half like I have this side so I'm going to texture it all the way down and then we're going to get to painting I'm going to do the bottom half the same color as this over here which is, which is accessible beige by um, Sherwin Williams and then the top half is um, Swiss coffee by bear so that'll be the same colors over here as well but you guys it's all done all the way down the hallway my furnace might kick in, so I do apologize. And then I have the doors framed out. I did do a little bit of a lip on the end because I just liked the look. I just thought it was really cool. And I saw someone else do it on Instagram, so you know, I had to do it. So I got the door done. Uh, so when I do paint all of this, I think I'm gonna paint the door as well. And then I'm hopefully gonna get some black hardware. That's what I'm kind of leaning towards right now. It's either black or brass, but I'm thinking black and then our bedroom door, mine don't, excuse the mess in there, it's messy. But here's our bedroom door all framed out. So I'm gonna be painting all of the doors and the trim, like even the trim up around the doors, all accessible beige. I just think that'll look really nice. And then we have this part over here, which goes into our bathroom and I've got that all trimmed out as well. 
I am so happy with it. Eek, I can't wait to paint it all and get it all finished. Okay friends, so that was all to share with you guys in today's video. All I did was the trim and the beadboard wallpaper. Next step is to get all the texturing down on the top half and then get some hooks and then paint and all the things. So that's all going to be in the next video. So I'm going to texture the wall and then I'm going to do some painting in the next video and then hopefully get find the hooks. Now I would love to do a gallery wall on the whole top half going down. I'm going to have to start collecting frames. I'm not going to have, I, I definitely don't have enough to do that right now, but I would love to do that in the future. So that won't be in next video, but I'm definitely going to be getting sorry glare um all of the hand texturing done and all of the painting done in the next video and i cannot wait i'm so excited to finally have this hallway done and then we'll get to the kitchen this half of the kitchen is still not done but we will get there we're making progress and i am so excited with all the progress that we have made we've only lived here since august and honestly we have made so much progress in this house and i am so grateful that i've been able to do all these projects and yeah anyways that is all to share with you guys in today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did please give it a thumbs up as it really helps me out and definitely consider subscribing if you enjoy these makeover videos thrifting videos decorating videos i do lots of those types of videos here on this channel and i would love it if you guys would consider subscribing and i will see you in the next one bye guys